Hello, hello everyone, how are you? We have this question, it says if a wire is stretched till its length increased by 50% of its original length, its resistance will increase by, let's write the information, so the new length is actually the first plus the increase, 50%, which is half, 0.5 L1, which means that L2 is actually 1.5 L1, okay? Uh, we know that when the length increases, the cross-sectional area will decrease, but the volume will stay the same, so V2 equals to V1. The volume, since the wire is a cylinder, is going to be A2 L2 equals to A1 L1. Okay, now I can substitute this. It's going to be A2 multiple 1.5 L1 equals to A1 L1. I can cut the L1 with the L1. So I have 1.5 A2 equals to A1. If I want to find A2 here, I just divide both sides by 1.5. So it's going to be 1 over 1.5 A1. Okay? So this is basically one of the informations I have here also the other information we have to pay attention to the question guys they say the resistance will increase so they don't uh, they're not asking about the new resistance they are asking about the increase okay i want to find delta r i want to find delta r which is basically r2 minus r1 this is the thing i'm looking for okay so let's uh, here let's find first r2 and then we find the difference so r1 over r2 equals here i put the main fraction it is resistivity length over area okay down here resistivity length over area notice that the resistivity is the same because it's the same wire the same material so we can cut row with the row okay now i apply math the furthest multiple the furthest over the nearest multiple the nearest okay i will have this is the main fraction so it's going to be l1 a2 over l2 a1 now i can substitute this and this okay so i'll use another color here I'll write again R1 over R2 equals the main here. L1 stays the same. Instead of A2, I can put 1 over 1.5 A1. Okay, down. Instead of L2, I can put 1.5 multiplied uh, by L1 multiple A1. Okay, so I can cut L1 with L1, A1 with A1. This will give me, this is the main, 1 over 1.5, okay, over 1.5. If you use a calculator, you will find 4 over 9. For some students, uh, they rush and they put the answer this, but actually it's not because we are not finished yet okay from here i write again r1 over r2 equals to 4 over 9 i do cross multiple okay i will have 4 r2 equals to 9 r1 let me remind you that we are looking for r2 in order to find the difference okay which means from here r2 equals 9 over 4 r1 we divided both sides by four now we find the difference let me change the color again i'll use this one okay so delta r equals to r2 minus r1 
which equals 9 over 4 R1 minus R1. I hope uh, you know how to do this from math. Of course, I can factorize. I can put R1 outside the bracket, and here is going to be 9 over 4 minus 1. You can use a calculator, so the change of uh, uh, delta R is going to be 5 over 4. 5 over 4. R1 of course. Okay, so the answer will be option C. Again, pay attention that here they are asking about the increase of the resistance. They are not asking about the new resistance. Okay, we pay attention to the question. Okay, if you have any question, please leave it under the video. Make sure to subscribe to get more uh, solution. Okay, have a great day. Bye-bye.